Hello, welcome back to the channel. Today's project is making a Buddha head. It's made of a stoneware, slab rolled, pinched to shape like a oval or egg shape and to form into the face of Buddha. Thanks for watching. So my style of sculpting is a free flowing sculpting. The goal is making sure inside is hollow. I always start thick slab, one inch is ideal in the beginning because I know I will thin them out later anyway. So I do uh, use heat gun to make it uh, stronger and to avoid collapsing. So piece by piece, I will add the top of the head, make sure it's uh, on a uh, rounder side or shape so I can uh, easily shape them for sculpting later. So as I connect the top of the head, I added more clay around. It's uh, by feel, I usually add coil, I add uh, chunks of clay just to get that uh, shape of the head. So the goal is to keep it uh, standing, strong, not collapsing. And I'm now starting to smooth the surface, getting ready for the detail of the facial features. If it's uh, deforming, like what you see here, I am using this styrofoam rounder big bowl shape and that will keep my shape uh, round and not to, be, to flatten. If uh, they're soft, the, the tendency is to flat on the table, so with the round big styrofoam bowl, it keeps that shape. So you see me hollowing out the bottom of the piece uh, and then I added the next dome to add the height of the head. So that's my technique. I, I uh, keep reattaching whatever is needed on top and once I know they're secure, I will reopen it, check the thickness and then once I know I'm satisfied with the height, that will be my final height and uh, start smoothing the surface so I can add the detail of the face. So that's about it. This will be the first part of this video and hopefully I can make the next, next video for you to watch. Again, thanks for watching. This is Seth Gozo from Seth Gozo Artist Corner. And the, the Yeah, whatever bowl you can. Is this okay? This little white one? Or is this, like... yeah, this one. 